So, you'd like to learn more about hydroxyapatite. I'll call it NHA for this video, nanohydroxyapatite. We know that NHA prevents cavities to the same extent as fluoride. They work under different mechanisms. NHA has the advantage of working better in dry mouths than fluoride does. We know that NHA reduces dental sensitivity better than fluoride by itself. You see, teeth are porous. The wider the pores, the more the sensitivity. Potassium nitrate and proarginine are additive ingredients in fluoridated toothpaste to block pores temporarily. NHA rebuilds missing tooth structure, reducing the size of those pores. NHA is a safer whitening agent. Fluoride toothpaste use microabrasive to scrub off surface stains. Bleaching destroys tooth structure. NHA rebuilds enamel which is naturally white. NHA is safe, but there is nuance. NHA is a synthetic particle, and it comes in many shapes and sizes. The one that's useful for dental care is raw shaped at under 100 nanometers per particle. Hence nano and not just hydroxyapatite. You can get larger spherical or needle shaped particles, but they're not as useful. The processing of NHA matters. Needle shaped NHA is potentially genotoxic, meaning it could damage your DNA. Potassium chloride and heavy metals are unwanted impurities of the NHA manufacturing process. You want higher concentrations of raw shaped NHA with minimal impurities. To my knowledge, the most heavily scrutinized supplier of high quality NHA comes from a Portuguese company called Fluidinova. They have a product line called NanoZim. This is the newest product. It is 50% NHA concentration with trace amounts of contaminants. That's good stuff. You can get zero contaminant NHA paste, but because it's so expensive, surgeons usually use them for bone grafting. To get an idea of the price, I paid 120 euros for one kilogram for high quality stuff. It's about 530 euros for a kilogram of surgical grade NHA. I make customized toothpaste for my clients. I like using the best stuff. Cold pressed, water distilled, or CO2 extracted flavor agents. No chemical solvents. You can customize the amount of sodium lauryl sarcosinate, not sulfate. I'm mindful of not killing the oral microbiome. It's a more gentle surfactant that disperses NHA more evenly over your teeth. You can also adjust your level of sweetening and scrubbing. I make batch orders once in a while. I usually only do this for clients I see face to face. I want to gauge the interest. If you're interested, follow me on Noster, comment on this video with the flavor you'd like. I'm trying out Zaprite. Pay me in Bitcoin. I'm thinking about 75 USD for a 100 milliliter tube. 10% of proceeds will be donated to OpenSats. Pricey? Yeah. But it's time consuming work and there's bigger fish to fry. Like overhauling the entire Dell industry. If you're interested in how Fiat destroyed dentistry, check out my next video. Peace out.